Are you thinking about moving to Grand Prairie, Texas? This video is for you. Grand Prairie, Texas is the seventh largest city in Dallas County, and it's also the 16th largest city in the state of Texas. One of the advantages of Grand Prairie is that it's so centrally located. In fact, it's just 17 minutes from downtown Dallas. You're about 23 minutes from Lovefield Airport, 12 minutes from DFW Airport, and about 26 minutes from Fort Worth. Not to mention, if you're looking for entertainment, you wanna to go to a Cowboys game or a Rangers game, it's just about 12 minutes away, depending on traffic. That just shows you that everything is centrally located. Being in Grand Prairie, you can get to where you need to go as soon as possible. Another unique advantage of living in the Grand Prairie area is how close it is to shopping. So there's different things. You have the Trader's Village, you have the Grand Prairie Premium Outlets, not to mention you also have a lot of local grocery stores nearby. Now for me, I love going to the Grand Prairie Premium Outlets because I'm a Perry Ellis guy. That's my favorite suit of choice. And they have a Perry Ellis store there and they, they treat me right. They always put me in the right suits. So not only suits, but there's also so many other things you can do as far as shopping. But Grand Prairie has a lot of options and I think that's what attracts a lot of people to the city. Now, one of the biggest things that I love about Grand Prairie is all of the entertainment. Now, for me personally, me and my family, we're probably in Grand Prairie once or twice a month just for entertainment. Now, you got everything, starting with Epic Central. Now, being there at the Epic Central, they have Epic Waters, which is the largest indoor water park in North Texas with over 80,000 square feet. And the good thing about it is that it's open year round. They have different things from water slides and uh, flow riders and wave pools and cabanas. Like it's the perfect place because you know it gets hot in Texas. It's August right now, but if you want to have fun indoor and get wet and, and, and have that kind of experience, Epic is the best place to do that, especially here in the North Texas area. Another fun activity to do in Grand Prairie will be checking out Boulder. The Boulder Adventure Park is also a year round indoor entertainment center. Now they have everything in there as far as like rock climbing, you can do rope courses, you can do zip lining, you can even do archery. Yeah, I said that right. You can even do archery inside of Boulder. So if you're looking for something that's indoor, you wanna have fun, gotta check out Boulder. And the entertainment doesn't even stop there. There's also things like the main event where you can go bowling, uh, they have different arcades, just an, there's so many options in Grand Prairie, and I think that's what really attracts a lot of people to it. Then when you're back at that Epic Central, right, they have like live music on certain nights, and then you can also watch the water show, not to mention all the different restaurants from like Loop 9 Barbecue, or one of my favorites, which is Vador. My, my favorite dish there is probably the fajitas with the beans and the rice. It's just amazing. So me and my wife, we go there very frequently. The water show, the sun setting, it's just a great atmosphere. And it's on two levels, right? So you can be on the ground level where everybody's at, or you can go up top and you really get a nice view of the water and the sunset if you're on that back patio area. So just another great reason why people love living in the Grand Prairie area, especially when it comes to entertainment. Also, if you have the need for speed, you got to go check out Andretti's. It just opened up this summer and it's just phenomenal. It's huge. It's in a great location. It's tons of fun, whether you're having kid, fun with your kids or adults having fun. It's, it's a great opportunity to experience that here in Grand Prairie, Texas. Now, if we leave the Epic Central area, there's also other things that you can do in Grand Prairie that's a little bit more natural or nature-based type activities. And one of those would be going to Joe Pool Lake. Now, Joe Pool Lake is 7,740 acres, and it's technically located in three different counties, being Tarrant, Dallas, and Ellis County. Now, Joe Pool Lake includes a number of parks, paved boat ramps, public swimming areas, and a public marina. Now, when me and my family first moved to Texas, I remember the first time we saw this lake and we're just like in love because 
I've grown up around water my whole life and I was moving to Texas knowing I wasn't going to be so close to the beaches and stuff like that. But just seeing that water and, and, and having that nature and that openness was just an amazing uh, feeling for me. And it kind of helped me get settled in a little bit more uh, just to be around that large body of water that we have at Joe Pool Lake. OK, so let's talk about the schools here in Grand Prairie. According to Niche.com, Grand Prairie ISD is ranked the 11th best school district in Dallas County with an overall grade of a B. They also have a student to teacher ratio of 15 to 1. Now, there's also plenty of schools to choose from here in Grand Prairie ISD. So just depending on the age of your kids, if you have kids, um, Grand Prairie ISD has plenty of options when it comes to education. Now let's talk about the cost of living here in Grand Prairie. Now, if we look at a website like payscale.com, where it says Grand Prairie is 3% higher than the national average when it comes to cost of living. However, it's 7% lower than the national average when it comes to housing, which means there's definitely some opportunities here. You got to think about it. If you're living in Grand Prairie and you have all of these amenities around you from Andretti's to Epic to the water parks to the main events, Boulder to the restaurants, all of this around you, you definitely got a lot of options. It's like you're, you're, you're getting what you pay for when you live here. And speaking of living here, what we can do now is go and take a tour through a neighborhood. I just want to show you guys a few homes here in Grand Prairie so you get a better idea for what the houses look like. So let's go take a look. Okay, so today the first home we're gonna look at is a Stonehaven 2F model. And this is a five bedroom, four bathroom, 4,117 square foot home. Come inside, let's take a look. Okay, so we're at house number two. Now this one is a Brentwood model. It has five bedrooms, four bathrooms, 
4,293 square feet. Let's go inside and take a look. Thank you for watching today's video. If you have any questions about moving to Grand Prairie, our contact information is in the description box. No matter if you're moving in seven days or seven months, my team and I would love to help you make your next move your best move here in Grand Prairie, Texas. Once again, my name is Brandon Small. Let's make it happen.